I enjoy a little company every now and then. Enough of this shit! You're coming with us, old man! Drop your weapon! Why don't you do the same? Then we can all talk in a civilized manner. Stop! Please! What are you doing to him? Him? An unusual choice of words for a Rust Crew soldier. I have focused the machine's AI on the concept of suffering. It was easy enough. He's a Bergen model, and they stole much of their code from me. Help me! Damn it, Almanon, that's enough! Now, don't do anything stupid. We're here to take you with us to Geneva. Oh, I never do anything stupid, Sergeant Marshall. And why is Geneva so interested in me? I think you know damn well why. You've created hollow children, violated Clause 21! <sighs> Is that all? Look, you're making an old man nervous. Put your gun down. I don't think so. It wasn't a request, Sergeant. Look out! Hey! Kane, you useless son of a bitch. Bonsoir, monsieur. Dan, stop it! Please, stop! You should have stopped him. You were crying. I should have done something. It's just a robot baby. It's all over now. Give me the bat. No! About time, Sleeping Beauty. Uh, what the? Uh, what is this, a garbage dump? Uh, where's Faye? My mother took a dirty old geezer. Dumped us in here. You didn't take my headset. Didn't take all our weapons either. Hey, can you call out? No. It must be too deep in the complex for me to get a signal. That solves one mystery. What the hell are you doing in here with us? You're a cop, right? I've been asking myself the same question. <laughs> a great detective. Totally stumped, huh? Huh. And you've been doing so good. Tell me, Shindo, how's your little hideout these days, huh? You son of a bitch! Oh, perfect. Damn it. Hey, ladies! How about we focus on getting out of here instead of slapping each other like a bunch of little kids? Now, where exactly is this... this place? Has to be one of the lower floor with all the chutes. But why they keep us here at all? Instead of just killing us, I know. <laughs> Maybe they've got other plans for us.
time to let these scrapheads finish us off! Whoa! Are you sure you don't have some robot in your family tree? Yeah, you do pull off some crazy stunts, Dan. Get out of here. I was born in Nebraska, I got two parents, I just work out a lot, all right? Could be false memories. I've seen movies like that. Listen, damn it! If I was a scraphead, Amida could have shut me down. Did Kane. Now let's get to work. <laughs> Shit! I don't want to die without getting cut off. I think it would be a pity in death for a scum like you. Funny, I was thinking the exact same thing about you. Even I'm in the kick. I'm surprised you've stayed alive this long, Kurosawa. I figured you'd be dead by now. Why don't you just go and get yourself Kirot? It'll save me the trouble of arresting you. Hey, Dan. Can I shoot this guy or what? Looks like I got the all clear, Kurosawa. I'm in no mood to play your stupid games. Oh, lighten up. I'm joking. Half joking. All right, Dan. Let's go. These zombie scrub heads remind me too much of Yoshiki. I just don't get what Amada is planning. Why make robots that look like people? Sorry, not possible. Negative. Won't happen. What was the deal with those old beat up robots? My guess is they are failed prototypes from the Haru children. Shit! These things were everywhere. Keep your eyes peeled. The enemy could be almost anywhere. I don't need you to tell me that. Resistant scum. I wasn't even talking to you, asshole. Shit! They're coming through the network! Oh, you're not all talk after all! Kick ass! <laughs> Kick ass! Ah, yeah, even I'm impressed! Even I'm impressed. Damn! We hit a dead end! No, this should open if we turn it. Come here, Shindo. You cops ever heard of the word please? Shit! It's not going to open that easy. We have a big pack of those things coming from behind! You gotta be kidding me! Hey, Dan! Looks like we hit another delay! Almost open! Hold out just a little longer! Kick ass! Reloading. What the hell, Dan? Do something! I thought the rush crew was the best of the best!
Feels like we've been here forever. Is there even a way out? How would I know? Ah, sh shit! Look at all of them! Hey, we better get out of here. What? Shit! What did I tell you? Hey, you're trying to <laughs> shoot me? <laughs> Even I'm impressed. She's ah. looking good. We can get up now. Another one of these doors. Stop your whining. Now let's open it. Yes, sir, Sergeant. Sir. Shit! They're attacking from behind again! You know the drill, Dan! This is it, man! Don't give up! Ah, even I'm impressed. What the hell, Dan? Do something! I thought the rush crew was the best of the best! <laughs> nice work. Almost open! Hold on just a little longer! So, you're not all talk after all! Just a little longer! Hang in there! <laughs> uh, even I'm impressed. Finally, let's go. So, you're not all talk after all. Look at all this. Even more garbage than before. Shit! We got enemies hiding in the trash too? Better look at I. The enemy's concealed in the garbage. Hey, you trying to shoot me? Hold your ground. It's almost over. Me? What's wrong? Hey! Maybe that's the exit over there. Can't wait to kiss the shithole goodbye. Not literally if I can help it. Hey, check it out. Isn't that an elevator? Maybe it'll take us back up. Come on, let's give it a try. The enemy's Shit. running down! We gotta Don't do give up! Me? What is it? Is he trying to kill me? He's a king! Let's hurry up and hey, go. Hey, step on it! What are you doing? Hurry up! Move! Ha! This is it. Shindo, hurry up! On my way! Whoa. Shindo! What are you doing? Come on! No! You're going ahead! What? What the hell is that supposed to mean? Just go! Got some unfinished business to take care of. Shindo!
Yosuke. How could you? This is how it has to end. What was up with him? I guess we'll never know. We gotta keep moving. Base to Beetle 2, are you receiving? Base to Beetle 2, are you receiving? Base, this is Beetle 2. Loud and clear. There you are. I thought the survivor's luck had finally run out. Yeah, well, stick around. It could still happen. What's Beetle 1's 20? R&D floor. I'll notify him you're on your way. Yeah, well, we found Amada. He's no spring chicken, but he's no pushover either. In other words, you failed to apprehend him. Yeah, well, you know, I figured I'd wait until the whole team could share in the glory. Very funny. Base out. Just when I thought we escaped the trash dump. Now this. I say we get out of here before we get ambushed again. A dead end. Wait, I think there might be a way out. Looks like I was right. Let's move. Damn it! Damn, it's right. I almost shot you. It's about time you showed up. And who's your friend? Hey, relax. It's a long story. But he's good. All right. Now listen. We met up with Amada, but he got away. He took Faye and Kane with him. Well, that's too bad. But look what we found. Was that the production data on the Hollow Children? Yes, it is. And it's all the evidence we need. There's one problem, though. It proves Armada violated Clause 21 and a whole bunch of other clauses besides. But it also proves something else, too. Armada's tech is 50 years ahead of everyone else. Including Bergen. Well, that's... I mean, that's impossible. <laughs> oh, oh, crap! Greg! Or not. Base to Beetle 2, we have a situation. Uh, anything to do with that tremor we just felt? Be thankful that's all you felt. The U.S. Milcom network is under attack. By Amada. CyberOps is fighting it, but they're moving too fast. Amada already has executive level access. Uh, that's bad, right? All autonomous NC vessels worldwide have initiated Complan Order 0988. They're broadcasting a counterfeit satellite signal to maintain control. 0988, that's a mutual destruction order. But why would Amida do that? We don't know. Wait a minute. We just found out how he's doing it. Amida made robots worldwide and powered down. Major, I don't understand. They're being networked together. Every Amida machine in the world is joining up to form a massive distributed system and attacking Milcom with it. Wait, rewind. So what was that tremor? The order test missile was fired at the Tokyo seawall. Shit! What other targets are in the comm plan? The usual suspects. Every capital city around the globe. And there's one new target. Not in 0988. The Amada Corp building. 
What? This right here is the most insane shit I ever heard. It's because of this, ain't it? They're gonna blow themselves up rather than risk being exposed. Bloody hell! Come on, there's gotta be something we can do. Sure, just stop that counterfeit signal. But first you have to find it. You need a clear line of sight to broadcast a satellite uplink. Right, and that means it has to be somewhere exposed. Does this building have a, a large antenna? Uh, something really big. Just let me think. Yes. Yes, there's a large parabolic dish up on the roof. Jesus. Major, how long till launch? Fifteen minutes. All right, we have fifteen minutes to take it out. Kurosawa, alert the Japanese authorities. Missile incoming. Are you serious? Just hurry, now go! Stop. Let's do this. Got my back, bro. You saved my ass. gonna disable that thing with a monkey wrench. Hey Rachel, did an RPG hit take out that thing? Sure, but only if you hit it dead center from the front. I'll have to go around. You heard the lady. Let's go. Doggy? Guess he ain't housebroken.
in the sky! Well done! Let's roll, people! Over here, bro! Stop dragging your ass! Rachel, your RPG. Hey, this dog ain't done yet. Hey guys, excuse me. Dan, over there. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, holy shit! Hey, bro. About time some of this survivor shit rubbed off on me, brother. Make it in time. Not bad for a day's work. Can we go home now? The president is conducting an emergency UN summit right now. Whatever happens, Amida is finished. The president has agreed to a military intervention in Tokyo to enable Geneva to conduct a full and proper inspection. Amida's arrest is only a matter of time. Now that's more like it. Come and get us out of here, Major. Whoa, whoa, hold on. We're not going anywhere without Faye. Amada's still got her somewhere. Dan, listen, forget about Faye. No, screw that! You go on ahead if you want to. But I'm not leaving Faye alone with that madman. That's not it. There's something you should know. Oh, shit. There's an airborne unit on its way to you now. Hold your current position. Uh, no can do base. This building is falling down around our ears. We'll get to a safe location and resume contact. Let's go. 
You know what I said about that survivor thing rubbing off on me? I think I could do it some more. survivor for a long time. Don't give yourself too much credit. I need to work out more. <laughs> oh, everybody here? What is it? Holler if you're dead, huh? Oh, it's very funny. Really cute. And no, not everyone is here. Damn, man, listen. No, Bo, Faye is still somewhere in that complex. And Amida has her. Yes, he does, but... Look, you go get airlifted out of here if you want to, okay? Go ahead. But I am not leaving without Faye. Dan, Faye being alive is not the issue here, brother. Amida's hollow children. Don't just look like us. They are incredibly advanced tech. What are you saying? I'm saying that the females he created, the ones that are named on this chip. What? <laughs> no. No, that's bullshit. Look, don't you dare try to tell me that Faye is a... a, a scraphead. Look, she took a bullet from me. I stitched her shoulder back up myself. She's just flesh and blood. You're not listening, soldier! Female hollow children can be impregnated by a human male. What? We told you Armada's tech was insane, man. The women can have kids. So you're right, okay? Faye is not a hollow child. But her mother was. Look, mate, the data here proves it. Okay, and Faye is not alone. Armadale records show 108 undocumented births by both robot and human parents. It's some sick shit. Dude thinks he's settling down with a nice girl. Turns out he's knocking up some hollow child. Ugh. 
and the hybrid offspring leave no mechanical traces. Okay? They're strong, they're fast, resistant to disease, but completely undetectable. No. No, this is all wrong. I okay, Faye probably didn't even know it herself until Amadar got a hold of her. But ignorance is no defense. The brass wants her taken out, and she is a direct violation of Clause 21. <laughs> Son of a bitch! Her, we never would have made it here in the first place! Speak for yourself, Sergeant! I'll kill you! Yeah. What? This party ain't over yet. Exfil team's on its way, and the heliport's still a ways up ahead. We ain't got time to argue. You know what I'm saying? I'm not done with you, Commander. Grow up, Marshal. You're trying to kill me, aren't you? Forget about it! Let's go! I think that's it. Okay, let's make for the heliport, quick. We have a rendezvous with the air unit. Dan, hold up a minute. Look, I know you must have been shocked about Faye, but are you all right? We were all shocked as well. I mean, after all this, Faye's a scrap. She's not human. Listen, don't get angry, but something happened between you two, didn't it? It's written all over your face. But listen, you can't think about her like that. Not anymore. She's right, brother. Faye's the enemy now. Plain and simple. Don't waste your breath, though. He obviously isn't listening right now. Let's move. Roger that. Stop dragging your feet! Remember doing anything special? We're almost done! Suck it up! Can't keep it off more than a chew! Well done! Oh, where did that come from? 
Heliport is supposed to be this way. What a strange door. Completely. But we've no time to worry about it. We're going in. A chapel? In the middle of a corporation? Yeah, well, don't get your hopes up. You probably pray to Amagar. He's the one playing God around here. Uh, looks clear. Dan. What? She's not human, man. You gotta forget about her. Faye is not a scraphead. You heard Charlie. No mechanical traces. Exactly, which makes her more dangerous. Dangerous? To who, Bo? She saved my life, man. I'm not going to abandon her to some sick experiment of Amidas. Listen to yourself. Her mama was a scraphead. That makes Faye a scraphead, and you are a scrap lover. You say that again. Say it again, damn it. Oi! You pair. You two been very long. The pipe down and get over here and help. Ah, shit. <clears throat> Charlie, what exactly do you expect to find? I'm not sure. I got a bad feeling about this. Now he. <laughs> A dead body. Who could have expected that? Uh, very funny. What I'm more interested in is, is who this is, and why he has pride of place here. Who cares? It's probably just Amida's father or something. Please, just give it a second. Let me analyze the DNA. This can't be right. What, it's not his dad? No. It's Amada. Yoji Amada. <laughs> I think your little gadget's broken there. We just saw Amada a couple of hours ago. I... Shit. Incoming! That's Amada! What the bloody hell's going on here? Could we focus on the current situation, please? We can worry about Amada later. Don't you think I know that? Right. 